So, I have bad news. I just got an email from Second Chance Greyhounds, and I've been rejected. Good morning, world. Good morning, internet friends. Good morning, everybody. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. Anxiety when sleep is not your friend. We've been adding on to the list all day today. Good morning, internet friends. How are we doing today? One more, it's like 1.30, but oh well. Um, I'm okay. I'm tired. Um, didn't get home till like 3.30. And then I slept most of the day. <laughs> um, I've got so much crap I have to do. I need to put away laundry. I need to wash my shoe that I stepped in mud. And I need to shoot two videos and do the vlog. And I feel like I have so much to do and... <sighs> My brain is just too tired to actually want to do anything. But I'll try. I will try to do it, so. Yay! Um. But uh, yeah. Just wanted to give you guys a quick check-in and say good morning. And I'll check back in with you later. Hey, guys! Oh, Lord, of course my hair is weird. Hi, Sassers. Say, Riddler and I went with Dad and Tyler. We went to Edwards Park. But we didn't stay out there too long because it was really hot, and Dad forgot to pack us water. And now I'm finally calm and sleeping. Like, I have no idea that Raven is talking to me. And twitching my sleep. Looks like she's having a dream. Get that squirrel, Sassy. Get that squirrel. So, I have been hardly doing anything. <laughs> I'm just so tired, and my head hurts. I think staying out late didn't help. Um, I went downstairs to eat something, and then I got laundry done. I put my laundry away, so yay, there's something. And um, I'm getting the vlog worked on right now. I'm planning out pressing the panda buttons video, and then I have no idea what to do for close enough cosplay. I think what I may do is like a what's in my bag, but it'd be a three-part thing. Like, first part will be what's in my prop box. Part two will be what's in my craft box. And part three be what's in my cosplay box. So, I may do that later today. But, yeah. It's been a very chill Sunday. Um, weird thing happened last night, though. I've been noticing for the past few nights, I've been having nocturnal panic attacks. Like, I'll be having a dream, and then I'll have a panic attack in that dream. And somehow, like, my body's responding to it as a panic attack, and I wake up from it. And I get so confused, and I'm like, what the crap just happened? Like, and these panic attacks are actually a lot stronger than they are in the day. So, I'm just like, why is this coming up now, and what can I do to stop it? Because I looked online about what it was, and I saw things that are like, oh, you can't manage those, you have to cure it. And I'm just like, you can't cure a mental disorder. That's not how this works. That's not how any of this works. But, um... I'll get it figured out. I don't know why I'm getting nocturnal panic attacks lately, but I mean, my panic disorder and anxiety disorder does not help with that at all, so... Yay! But, yeah. Just gonna continue to work on the vlog. Just wanted to check in on you guys since hardly anything's happened today. And I'll check back in with you later. Hey guys, so I just got back from feeding chickens, and Riddler is in serious, serious trouble. Okay, so we have some ducklings. They are from... The dad is one of our ducks. The mom is a duck that just showed up from the neighborhood. And so they've been living here. Um, so Riddler loves to go out to me with, with me to the barn to feed chickens. He'll usually hang out in the barn, no big deal. Well, I was getting feed for some of our ducks, and I hear this baby bird screaming. And I was wondering why, and I came back out. Riddler had the one of the ducklings, and they're pretty big at this point, had one of the ducklings in his mouth and was about to run off with it. So, I made him drop it. He went for a while, and as horrible as this sounds, I had to smack him to get him to let go. Because he would not let go of the baby duck. And, usually I do not hit my animals as punishment, but this was another animal's life in my dog's mouth. And I was not about to let him get the duck, especially since he has been trained to not go after the ducks. So he got in very, very, very big trouble for... Go for trying to get the duck. Luckily, baby duck is fine. I had to wrangle it from its mother just to check it 
and it was just wet from Riddler, but it wasn't bleeding. It was, it ran off. It was still screaming, so it's fine. It's probably going to be a traumatized duck. So, and I mean, he's never been trained to go after the ducks. He knows to be nice around the ducks. This is the first time he's ever done it. So maybe it's also partly genetics since, I mean, he is a hunting type of dog. But he got in very big trouble for it. I will tell you that. Because that is not okay for him to go after a baby duck. But yeah, now we're back inside. Riddler's still grounded. He's in trouble. Um, I'm looking up service dog fundraising things. And a lot of them have to do with like, oh, you should have a picture of your service dog. Well, I don't have a picture of him because I don't know if I'm the program completely yet. I'm hoping I am, but yeah, there's that, so I just wanted to give you guys that lovely story of Riddler trying to kill a duck, and I'll check back in with you later. Hey guys, so I have bad news. I just got an email from Second Chance Greyhounds, and I've been rejected. Um, apparently I did not fulfill all of their criteria, which I'm not exactly sure what that means, like what criteria that was, but... Uh. I don't know. I'm contacting um, Greyhound Advancement Center again to see if they'd want to take me, but I'm just not happy. I feel like I've jinxed myself and that I've screwed everything up. Like I've been trying so hard for a service dog and everything I do just fails. I don't know what to do anymore. The only other thing I could think of is that I've heard that um, the breeder where Riddler came from is now going to be starting corgis. And so I thought about going back to corgis, but I just don't know. I'm absolutely heartbroken. This just sucks. And I hate the fact that I'm even crying on camera, but I mean, this is just life. Getting a service dog is not easy at all, and if you're starting the process of it, just know that already. It's going to be a hard battle. Like, I've been on this for a year, <laughs> and just any program I've looked at, like, it's been too expensive or too far away. This program, it was just that I didn't fulfill all their criteria, which I don't even know what that was, and just, I don't know what to do now. I just feel like a failure, and... And that's about it. Hey guys, so what am I thinking of? My brain is so tired right now. <laughs> um, so went out to eat at cookout, which it sucks, but whatever. Then I came home and I literally watched YouTube videos. And now I've got my meds in and it's time for me to go to bed. Um, I ended up not shooting the video for close enough cosplay or pressing the panic panic button so either those videos will come out later in the week or I may not do them till next week because I'm just tired I mean that happens guys <laughs> so there's that um as for the Greyhound thing um at this point I think what I'll do is just anticipate every time that I apply that I will get rejected because the way I see it if you do that if you anticipate that you will be rejected if you do get it, you feel awesome. But if you don't, you don't feel as crushingly disappointed. Because I thought I was going to get this adoption with second hand, second chance greyhounds. And clearly that didn't happen. So we'll just see what the world has. So now is when I sign off for the night and head off to bed. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world's got for you today. And... There doesn't have to be a question of the day today. If you wouldn't mind, like, I don't want to sound like an attention seeker, but I need some encouragement, please. If you don't mind posting that in the comments. Because I do read y'all's comments. And, of course, those who have actually been commenting, you know, because I'll usually give you a thumbs up or I'll reply back. So, I just really need some good vibes since this whole Greyhound thing has let me down. So, just... Put whatever you want down below, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye-bye, Sassy. Good night. Bye-bye, Riddler. Good night.